here. Like, and then all of a sudden, you kept getting better and better and better. You're writing more and doing more. And honestly, when I said I expected certain things from you, you guys came through. And you were so much better. Your ELA tests, I mean, we had like 75% of this class get twos or ones. That's not passing. It's, I'm going to say, it's day and night difference. What you guys did on New York State tests, so much better. So much better. I can't say for sure that every single kid passed with flying colors, but I know that we were easily way over 50% or better. Last year, 75% failed. This year, easily, easily half that, easily. I, I personally think there's only one person who didn't finish the test, so I don't know if they're going to pass or not, but every other per every single person finished, checked over the work, had a quality essay, did all the right stuff. Remember your essay format. You'll use those the rest of your life. It'll just be bigger and longer. That's all. But more importantly, back to you guys, um, thank you for an awesome year. You guys were really, I'm going to be honest, this made for a really easy year for me. Uh, you guys know outside of the classroom I had a lot of bad stuff happen, unfortunately. You know, you get years like that. Bad things happen, you know. But, you know, you guys made it easier. When I came back from taking care of Mrs. Finn and, and, and then some other things happened, you know, with people passing away and stuff, you guys really were awesome. When I came back, I didn't have to clean up a lot of stuff. You guys were really good and respectful. And you know what? I'll always remember that. That, that meant a lot to me. Yes? Um, is, is this Ms. Ms. Finn's uh, back? Yeah. She'll be back next year. She, she had to take a year off. She'll be back. Yeah, she'll be back. As a matter of fact, we're going to be teaming next year. So. Yeah. All the tens are back in action. Back in black. That's right. Mm -hmm. so, um, so we should be good. Um, but I hope you guys have an awesome summer. I really do. I wish you guys the best of luck. You know, I, I hope you take into consideration the things I said yesterday about hard work, okay? And, you know, setting goals. Guys, set those goals, man. Because without goals, you're just driving the car. You have nowhere to go. Even if they're small goals. Like next year I want to get all 90s. Or, you know, next year I want to meet more friends. You know, in the beginning of the year we did 5th grade goals. I'm going to tell you, 6th grade goals. I'm going to tell you, next year we're not going to do 7th grade goals. Andrew, they didn't have you guys do goals for this year, no? So what do you do on a little piece of paper? Remember I said in your folder, your, your agenda? Do me a favor. Write down a couple of goals that you set for yourself. See if you can achieve them. You know what I mean? So... You know, guys, I really enjoyed being your teacher, and, you know, best of luck next year. And I hope you guys have a great summer. Anybody going anywhere really fun? Yeah. I'm going to Gary Lights twice a month. Awesome. <laughs> Disney. Disney. Very cool. Say hi to Mickey for me. Myrtle Beach. Myrtle Beach. Little Beach. Awesome. Guys, have a great